What are you waiting for? Come join the Geek Drums Nation. What's up guys? Welcome to today's video. In today's video, we will be talking about the ending of Power Book 2 ghost and by ending yes i mean this is the final season guys um as you can see by the title of this video yes the show was canceled and this article will tell you a lot but before we dive into this if you are new here please check out my channel like this video share this video around to your friends family you know uh on your social media pages if you will and hit that subscribe button turn on the alert bell so you never miss another one of my videos now yes guys i talk about more than just you know comic books you know flash stuff like that comic book films tv i talk about more stuff than that guys i love you know procedural dramas like law and order Grey's anatomy stuff like that um i love power i love the power series i love all the power shows i love the shy stuff like that guys i'm just a tv film enthusiast you know all together you know and i might review this upcoming season since it is the final season of the show uh, but let's dive into this deadline article and um, let's see what they're talking about. So Power Book 2 Ghost to end with season four. And by that, guys, yes, you know, normally I said, oh, it's not in this getting the final season. But um, Michael Rainey was on live and he said he just found out today when we found out that the show was that this was the final season. So they went into this season thinking they were getting, you know, getting a season five. So I hope this season does not end on a cliffhanger. If it does, I'm going to be upset because I hate cliffhanger endings. I hate unplanned cancellations. But we're going to dive into this. We're going to dive into this. Okay, so it says right here, uh, let me just blow it up for you guys too. Fans of the Power franchise are losing Ghost again, but this time it's the series. Stars has canceled Power Book 2 Ghost with, it, with the show's fourth season to serve as its last. It will be broken into two parts, premiering June 7th and September 6th. Uh, watch the teaser above. Uh, I'm sure everybody did. I'll watch it later. Uh, I mean, I've seen it already, but I'll watch it again. I just don't trust YouTube. I don't know how Stars will handle that. You get it. I, I, I don't want this video to get taken down and blocked. Um, the move was prefaced by Star CEO Jeffrey Hirsch this week when he revealed plans to contain content costs by developing more new shows versus sustaining series series longer as they become more expensive. Now, yes, that means he decided to cancel Ghost because it's an extension of the original power. But I knew yesterday when they said all of this in a, you know, uh, a, another huge article uh, before they announced that they were, you know, expanding the power franchise with uh, the Ghost and Tommy Prequel cool series. I knew something was up. I just didn't know this was going to be the something. I thought they would keep Ghost going and they would end up pulling maybe Force or maybe even BMF because BMF already got renewed for a season four. So I figured they would pull this. But I mean, well, I figured they wouldn't pull this, but you know, at the end of the day, it's a money thing. It's a money thing. So let's keep going. He said, while using the power franchise as an example, you look at uh, the power map and say, okay, if I take one of those characters out and spin one of those out, I can bring that on to replace the power show at half the cost. Basically, he can bring in new actors and pay them less. So uh, a, a Ghost and Tommy prequel series is potentially cheaper because you're gonna bring in potentially newbie actors or younger actors that don't cost a lot. As whereas in uh, Ghost, you know, you gotta pay Method Man, Mary J. Blige, Michael Rainey's probably racking up the bag because he's been in the show for, he's been in this franchise for so long since he was a kid. Um, Woody McClain, all of these, you know, top notch actors, you're, you're paying them a lot. So, and the show is, the show has to be extremely expensive, especially to be running this long. As the longer a show goes, the more it costs to produce. So starting from scratch with a spinoff that people have been wanting is basically a quid pro quo. I guess you could say it like that. Either way it goes, it sucks. So um, now I'm putting a lot of money right to the bottom line. And I'm really not losing anything in terms of acquisition costs and subscriber viewership. Oh, you're gonna lose viewership. As much as people want to see a Ghost and Tommy prequel in the vein of Raising Canaan, you're alienating a whole bunch of fans who are, fa you know, a whole bunch of fans who wanted to see potentially, you know, Ghost 
they wanted to see Ghost return in Ghost. They didn't want the show to end with season four. The original power went up to what, like season six? I expected this to go up to at least season five at the most, you know. Uh, but hey, I, I don't, I don't know, I don't know. Um, they, this is a money thing, guys. This is a money thing. Um, but now it says everything is playing out as he revealed on Wednesday. Stars announced plans for a new prequel series following everyone's favorite power duo, Ghost and Tommy. The series will be in the same vein as Power Book Three, Raising Canaan. Like I said today, Ghost is dead. Um, if you look at the Starfield Ensemble Power Book 2, which was the obvious choice when guessing which show would be cut first, like I said, Michael Rainey Jr., who plays Tariq St. Patrick, son of Ghost, played by Amari Hardwick in the Mothership series, is one of the last remaining original members of the franchise. Then you have the musical powerhouses of Mary J. Blige and Cliff Method Man Smith and Lorenz Tate, who has been booked and busy since the 80s. And that's only to mention a few. So, you know, it just goes to, you know, list like what power is and all of that stuff. I'll link the article in the description down below. But, um, yeah. So, the series is ending. And, I mean, I said this to a couple friends today. Uh, to wit, Power Book 3, Raising Canaan, is now shooting its fourth season. And the end could also be near following the news of the new spinoff Origins. However, Origins could be a vehicle for the character of Canaan played by 50 Cent and Power and Makai Curtis and Raising Kenny to continue as Tommy and Ghost's first interaction with their favorite foe could happen in the new season, leaving younger Kanan available, able to cross over, excuse me. But yeah. So then, you know, we still got Power Book Force filming its third season. I don't... The third season could be the final season for that. So, I mean, guys, let me know let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Uh, this video is a little bit long. Well, seven minutes. It's not that long. But let me know what you think down in the comment section down below. How are you feeling about this? Are you a fan of power? Have you ever seen the show? Let me know down below in the comment section. Like I said, please like, share, and subscribe. Become a channel member today if you want to. And uh, yeah, if you want to hear more about other shows besides comic book things, that's what I'm going to be doing on my channel going forward. That's how I want to do in this new year. And uh, yeah, guys, I'll catch you later. Power canceled power that's that's crazy